Mentos. <laughs> That's where I was going with that, Mel. Nicely done. Wow. Have you guys I ever dropped one in Diet Coke? Like uh, taking a shit in a Diet Coke? No, no <laughs> the, Mentos. the Mentos. You fucking crazy man. <laughs> Ooh. Blessed. I never dropped one myself, but... Oh, you know what? No, I dropped one in a regular Coke and was real sad when it didn't work. It didn't work. Yeah, because it has to be diet. I think it's the aspartame. Is that what does it? Yeah, it's one remember. of the artificial sweeteners. I'm pretty sure. And you can't use candied Mentos either. It has to be mint. Really? Yep. Learn something new every day. It's the pores and the Mentos allow for the bubbles. And there's no pores in the candied ones. You That's don't true. say. <laughs> are you are you getting after those super box melt feet? Uh I did I did go out for some drinks with coworkers, but I don't have any super box unfortunately. What uh you were tweeting about that. What were they saying about teachers and YouTubers or something? Dude, I was just at lunch and I got I as brec innocent breakfast place is awesome. Is six uh you know, girls I think they worked at like some kind of law office and they're just going on. The one girl's like Oh, your sister's a teacher? Oh, it must be nice to have a lot of free time. Tell her to get a real job. Like <laughs> verbatim. Two one drop. And I I was like I wanted to say something. What you were with those people or you were not with those people? No. Oh complete strangers. Oh, uh, I thought they were your work buddies. No. Oh god. <laughs> I, my, <laughs> your little robot there, Mel. It's not Sorry, just I me had, then, okay. I had to tab out, so I'm gonna have oh, to actually was... pull my chute so I can get there. Um Yeah. Wow. The, it was a wild conversation. And then the one started talking about, she's like, and this is the one who trashed the teacher. She's like, maybe I'll just be a cam girl so I only have to work <laughs> one or two hours a day. And then they all were like, well, then they started talking about YouTube as an industry. And they're like, you know, these people, they just like, they put on makeup and they put on bikinis and they get all that stuff sent to them for free. And they make, they make 6,000 bucks a video. And it's just like, I don't know where you're getting these numbers from maybe that's true but are they I, <laughs> I, I guess so i don't know it's just like it's a very weird conversation i didn't i didn't really i didn't like them did you interject yourself into that conversation no but i did crop dust them as i left so. <laughs> do you think he is you <laughs> how tone deaf though to be like potentially in the world's most hated profession and be like talking shit about other professions. It's actually, yeah, it's true. Uh, what really gets me is they had about a 20 minute rant just about like, oh, well, Becky, she's got this. Becky this with the good hair? Becky with the gray hair, but she's got this cubicle, <laughs> but she's nasty. She never does her work, you know? She never she never gets her work done on time, so I have to do it. And then, and then, and then Tina, she got this cubicle, even though she doesn't deserve one that big, you know? And then she puts all her stuff on this other, other cubicle. Like, she's taking up so much space. And, like, I literally have to put my documents on the floor. It's so unfair. And it's like, I'm not making Wee. this shit up. That was, that was their, the gist of their conversation. There's an old saying. You want to hear what it says, Melf? Of course. A stagnant rock gathers the stank. That's exactly what <laughs> I don't. You're saying <laughs> I stink because I didn't interject or no, but... no, no. The, the, like birds of a feather flock together, more or less. Like if you're that wrong, if you're those wrong, those two <laughs> statements do not mean the same thing. If you're around that kind of like hatred and negativity, you become that hatred and negativity. You feel me? Are you thinking a, a, a Rolling Stone <laughs> gathers no moss? It's the opposite of that, though. <laughs> a stagnant stone gathers the stank. Gathers the stank. That's what it is. So what are you supposed to do as a stone? It sounds like there's no winning here. No, you, you can't win as a stone. You gotta move. But you gotta keep rolling. You yeah. gotta be around others. But then you got no moss. Yeah. That Dan, moss is a good thing in this metaphor. Yeah. How'd you do on the, your SATs? I didn't take SATs. What? Oh, ACTs. Uh, I'd rather not say. <laughs> 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 Why do you ask? 
it just seems like those are all about analogies, right? It's the uh, analogy competency test. So let me just give you a little bit of my standardized test background. I'm not one of those people saying I'm not good at standardized tests, but to get into the high school that I wanted to get it, that I didn't want to go to, my parents forced me to go to it. So you had to take a standardized test just to make sure that you could get in. Well, all I did is I just put all A's and like all A's <laughs> on the Scantron. Oh, so my mom gets the results back and just beside herself, she's like, what, what happened? You know, you, you know, I always did pretty well in school. I'm like, well, I don't want to go there. And they go, well, you're a legacy. So you're going there. Cause my sister went there. But mm. so anyways, I did the same thing with the ACT pretty much. <laughs> <laughs> like I took a mad, did you take no, ACT more than once? Cause I didn't, I didn't do that. Wait, what's the ACT again? ACT it's is, like the Eastern yeah. SAT. Yeah, yeah. Oh, okay. I took the the PSAT and the SAT, and I got mad because I did stupidly good on the PSAT. Like I got a fucking award for it or some shit. Stup stupidly well. Right. <laughs> no, that's the next part. Is I did just painstakingly average on like the SAT. So like the one that was actually important, I didn't really get anything for. The PSAT, they were like, oh, "Nice job, you did great. Congratulations." And the SAT, I mean. <laughs> Can't do much for you. Sorry. Is the PSAT the practice? Yes. It's the well, preliminary. I don't know what it is. Mm. But like, yeah, I didn't really get anything for doing well on that one. Real talk. Do you guys think that's a good indicator of intellectual aptitude? Apparently standardized tests are not very good at actually testing from what I've read and heard. Is that, do you believe, what about personally? Do, what do you guys believe? I think like if you do well on one, you're probably smart, but I think just because you do bad on one doesn't mean you're dumb. Yeah, I would agree with that. I like. I think it makes sense for colleges because like, it, it's kind of like a great equalizer. Like, what if you went to a school where they just mark like five percent easier by chance, basically? Like, maybe you're the smartest kid at your school, so you're getting like ninety nines, but you're actually an idiot compared to the average <laughs> school. You know, so. I think it's it can be a useful kind of like equalizer, but it does it measures more your ability to take tests, in my opinion, than your ability to, you know, reason things intelligently. Malf, how do you feel about standardized tests? Uh, aced it, you know. I don't well, know. in Canada, we take like none. Really? Unless you want to go to an when, American school. When you're really young, like in public school, I remember we had one for English and one for math. Um, we had to take a the texas standardized test every year uh from like elementary school all the way to high school i thought i forget i can't remember what it was called it had two different names oh it was the taas the tas when i was in third grade and yes. then it became yes it became something else oh the tax t-a-k-s i think every other year no mouth left was, behind it was the easiest test I've ever. Every year we'd have to sit in a room for the entire day and take three different tests for like social studies, math, and I think it was four. It was science, social studies, math, and like reading. And they were basically just stupid checks. Like that's all they were. <clears throat> well, that's in tenth grade we had to take like a literacy test. It was basically Ew. like they they hype it up for like the two years previous. They're like, you better be like competent on your literacy test and then the test is like susan has a watermelon question one what yeah. kind of fruit does susan have the that's watermelon. basically what the test <laughs> i was thinking yeah yeah <laughs> we gotta go though okay, okay. Uh, i'm just gonna there's a scar in here if anyone doesn't have a rifle yet uh, all right take, take 20. Well, we got a little bit of time to finish looting this little area i'm, I'm trading AK fully... for scarby unless someone wants the scarby i'll take the ak okay um, Ryan, I'm guessing you probably did exceedingly well in the standardized tests in Canada. Here you go. Well, not really, actually, because we sincerely just don't take many. Thanks. Unless if you're like a super genius, you take some, and there's like competitions. But um, I, I think honestly, I think Mike what? and I kind of went to like not that great of a school. <laughs> Why did like, we? We did we, the Euclid test though. Was that grade ten? Yeah, yeah. But What's that's like test? it's it's like exclusive. It's like. You might be able to pass this. You should try. Yeah, they're always like, well, the highest score at your school was like an 11 out of 100, and the highest score in your age group was like some kid in Waterloo got like a 99.9. .9. You're like, all right, well, <laughs> yeah. that really puts it into context. Like, we in uh, we were in different chemistry classes, but 
in uh, our chemistry class, our teacher picked like the four students with highest marks. And then he's like, hey, you guys write this like provincial chemistry test. Pretty we were right so, it. well, like take it, sorry. Okay. Um, we were so out of our depth. We were just like laughing as we wrote it in this back room because we had no idea what any of the answers were. And the way that the, the oh Jesus, I hate this. Um, the way that the scoring worked is like, if you didn't guess on a question, you got a zero on it. If you guessed incorrectly, you lost like a quarter of a mark or something. Yeah. So they incentivize like not guessing unless you knew roughly what the answer would be. But I just guessed, like basically what you did. I didn't take all A's, but I just did like a best guess. And then I ended up getting the highest mark in our module by like 0.25 with like a 28% or something like that. So, so you're at the, the top end of a bell curve, but the bell curve was, was a much yeah, bell. <laughs> Exact correct. Maybe like a you know a timpani curve. <laughs> so speaking of Bell today, I played uh, PUBG with a dude who is an award-winning Taco Bell cook, and I crap you not. <laughs> I'm coming. I'm coming. This area is still very lootable, though. No, no, no. We gotta go. The blue's like literally here. Ah, uh, okay. Um. Hey, did I leave an extended quick quick draw on that? Uh, uh yeah, you did. I can give it to you. It's okay. Know. No big deal. I just want to make sure someone had it. Ooh! But anyways, I guess at Taco Bell, they like teach people like everything down to how they scoop the meat is like down to a science. <laughs> I'm not even joking. I never well, would have thought like, that. It's very they, believable. Maybe but... send some fucking audits to the Taco Bell near me because it sucks ass. <laughs> There was like, there's this YouTube reviewer called um, Review of the Week who does food reviews and he's kind of like infamous online because he's like a really skinny guy and he wears like big suits in every episode. Oh, I know that guy. Yeah, and he, he does like overly serious fast food reviews and nobody's really sure if he's like completely self-aware or like what's going on. But he did a video recently called like My Problem with Taco Bell and he talked at his table for like 15 minutes and then he showed a side-by-side -side photo or video of like two tacos that he got and he showed the first one and he was like look at this there's like no meat in it and then he opened up the other one and he's like here's an example of a good taco and i looked at that taco and i was like that looks like animal shit the one on the <laughs> right actually had like some cosmopolitan color palettes and like it looked good he was like this is your standard taco here and he points to one that's like actually just horrifying. <laughs> anyway, uh, there might be people here. We should. Yeah, the doors are open. I think there's a slight bias towards his reviews, anyways, because I remember watching one. He was reviewing something from Wendy's, and he said it, like he got it a half hour ago, and then he set up the video and also. So by the time he was eating it, it was cold. Yeah. And I think that kind of factors into maybe your enjoyability of it. You know. Do you think he's doing it as like satire? Or do you think? He, you, what do you? 50-50. I think he's like, I think maybe he started it like as well-meaning. Well, not that it's like mean-spirited, but he's kind of like half playing a character now. The the dress-up part, like the putting the suit on is kind of like gimmicky, go blue. but I think okay. his yeah. actual reviews and stuff of the food, like that's that's sincere is what yes. I gathered. He, he rev Oh, we're out of gas. Mm. Okay, we'll I, I, I have gas. I have gas. Crash, just crash it, just crash it, just crash it. Can't you just hit spacebar? I'm pretty sure they fixed that. It's full. Well, it's <laughs> it's got some. Petrol. There's this other guy on YouTube. He wears like high waisted Dockers and tucks in like an Oxford shirt, and he does like sneaker reviews. Like, and he does this one where he gets Yeezys and then spends 30 minutes making his Yeezys. The laces look how Kanye wears them, and he does it in front of like a fireplace. <laughs> So he's like, it's like, imagine like maybe your 50 year old science teacher wearing like the latest sneakers and then yeah. dead panning the whole, whole thing. It's pretty funny, but you don't know if he's serious or not. <laughs> <laughs> There's always uh, damn drops. That's a boy. That's a boy. That's a boy. That's a boy. It's a boy. It's a boy. What drink? Yeah. At the, house. At the houses. He's by the shed. Weave it. Weave it. <laughs> Nice shot. Dude, that's spray control. I mean, we can go back. They're weak now. 
I like I've it. only got red, I've only got red dot, so got to get a little down close. behind that shack. Where do you want me to stop? Uh, right by these rocks. Oh, there's right. a guy on the left side of the White House. Instead of a White House, is a greenhouse. Instead left, of a greenhouse, left side of the White House. Okay, I killed the guy. He must have gone. Oh yeah, he's out and you he's see him in, in the front. house. Then. Yeah. I think we should pull up now. Everyone get in the car. Okay, you get in the car. Oh, oh, oh. oh. Get out of the car. Get out of the car. Get out of the car. Yeah. <laughs> Oh, I see him. He's in the window, top, the second from the left. Yep. Of the White House. Ow! I'm healing up first. Sometimes for the boys. One. Where do you want me to ram him at? You want me to ram him? Where is he? He's in the house on the second floor, oh, so... You see the muzzle flash in the yeah. second muzzle. window? Oh, I got him, got him. Oh, he's dead. Holy shit. Nice. Let's go. Nice. Ooh, nice car. Oh. No, you had a freaking snipper. Is that iron sights, Ryan? Yes, it was. Fucking A. <laughs> Daddy's been practicing. It's all in the race. Oh, they, they nicked a tire. Can't oh, you jerks. Oh, Dan's got one. Oh, oh jeez. <laughs> I tried to move that car. Good par parking job, Dan. <laughs> no problem. Boy, there's two teams here. I'm safe to pick up. Yeah, I got you. I got you. There's two boys out that house. The yeah, other house? Eyes on... Okay, Austin, you got I eyes see on... one by the boiler. No, oh, if I got oh. you, just come the other side. Come the other side. Uh, okay, they're, they might be coming towards me, though. Get okay. ready, Dan. Right. Oh, yep, he's there. There's what? one left. He's real weak, Ryan. Right on this corner. Right on this corner, Ryan. He's yeah, real weak. Uh, there's some here, too. Oh, my God. I can't believe there were two teams there. That's why I hate camping. Because there could be two teams camping beside each other, and you would never know. <laughs> I put the baklava on. I just never take it off. If I had one, I would have sold it. Really? 30 bucks. For it's the not Twitch bucks. baklava? It's not 30 bucks for the Twitch Dude. Prime balaclava. It's like, it is like, I think, like $5 or something, though. Something from the Twitch Prime is 30 bucks. The whole set's 30 bucks. Oh, that's it. That's what it is. The unopened set. Crazy. Actually, that I is... Did, the, did, this Battlegrounds, like, market is actually completely revealing who has no knowledge of uh, economics whatsoever. Like, people... The crates were $3 at some point. Now they're like... And I'm not deliberately, like, talking about you, Austin. But, like, the crates have dropped down to, like, a dollar. People are like, buy low. That's not. You're getting on a crashing plane, <laughs> dog. The game, they're gonna the game... be unavailable soon. Dude, they're only. The... They exist in August. They're gonna go fucking skyrocketing once. Yeah, the but you're opening them. <laughs> yeah, but you're I just not stockpiling them. You're... bucks. <laughs> I sold some of my good shit that I'm never gonna wear. I got twenty five dollars. What'd you yeah, sell? They... I sold the camo hat and the yellow and jacket and pants. Look, we're we're absent this because we also got ten for free, so we like broke the market on that. But people are like, you know, got got to buy low, sell high. It's there's eight hundred thousand people play this game for a collective total of like eighty million hours a month. <laughs> there's there, there's gonna be more crates on the marketplace, maybe not Gamescom, but there's gonna be more crates on the marketplace than like people on planet Earth within the next two months. I'm meant yeah. to push back against your macroeconomics there. I'm with Austin. Because of the rarity, at some point, they're going to be worth a lot more. If you buy Gamescom crates and hold them, maybe. I could see that. You also, I mean, you win big if you buy it and open, uh, like, a money item. But, you know, who among us doesn't have, like, eight slacks black in our inventory right now? <laughs> All I know is that I'm, like, barely, like, down five bucks on crates or something right now. So you can be mad at me, or you can just enjoy this lovely school jacket that I'm wearing that's also worth eight <laughs> bucks that I could sell. I also, though, I sort of worry that one day they're going to make a cosmetic item that doesn't look like garbage, and then people are going to be like, I'm not paying $200 for a skirt. Doesn't Kate want to buy a skirt? Yep, and I've, I've been speaking to her just more politely than I'm speaking to you at the present <laughs> moment, saying don't buy a $200 skirt. 
That's out of control. Guess oh. we're the only ones here? <laughs> Maybe because she went on StockX and bought some Yeezys. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's, uh, I've been trying to like get my opinion across that like luxury goods in real life, still probably not a great purchase, but in my opinion, a better purchase than uh, luxury digital goods. <laughs> See, that's why I like buying the crates. You get to play the game, at least. Since you're too helmet in here. Yeah, I mean, I would just wish they... I think they will at some point. I just want them to make it more, like, casino-like, like, Counter-Strike. <laughs> <laughs> I agree. <laughs> this is so anticlimactic. Yeah, I mean, it would be... They're already in, like... I, I mean, I'm not insulting them. I love the game, but... It, they're already in full scum territory doing, like... You know, paid microtransactions with basically slot machine mechanics in a game that already costs thirty dollars. Like, you, uh, just make it look a little better. Like, give you that little feeling. Like, maybe it's gonna be the skirt on this one instead right. of just like you click it and it doesn't even give you feedback on clicking the button and then it's like slacks black. <laughs> School suit. Why are they slacks in scum black. territory though? It's I not, don't think they are. I, I, I don't either. Yeah, just. I think they are. Why? But they're not. You, you don't, don't buy have them. to buy. Yeah, you don't have to. Buy I. Them. I agree with that, but I think that it's kind of like pushing the line a little to have an early access game <laughs> with paid gambling esque microtransactions in it. I, I, I'm believe you me, I am buying any crates on the Steam Marketplace, and I'm not saying like you're an idiot if you do. I'm just saying I think that that's. I mean, I wouldn't be comfortable doing that, especially given that in the past three months they've made like you know. 20 million dollars or something but you in my know mind like get mad at them for like basically lying and saying they weren't and then they did yeah oh, i like, mean that's the other aspect i guess that's that part out of that i get mad at that that's bullshit but like every game's gonna have microtransactions but not every game does have microtransactions like i'm kind of mad like it, it's csgo csgo set the precedent but i don't know it's just it's a little scummy in my world but if they're going to support it for, like, 20 years, which they will because, well, you know, 20 years is an exaggeration. But, you know, the reason they're in CSGO is because people buy it for 15 bucks and then they play for 3,000 hours. So they're like, hey, we want to keep getting a slice of the pie. This has only been out for, like, five months. Like, and to do it under the vise of or the, the guise of, like, well, we got to raise money for the prize pool. I'm like, come on, dog. As, like... Roger Goodall being like, "Hey, could you guys send us a ten dollar bill? We need to pay. <laughs> we need to pay for a new stadium. Can you guys like support us?" <laughs> Except they do millions. do that. Millions, I know, but you know, push back, man. I just don't like. I don't care. Like, people are like, oh, it's, "It's predatory," you know. It's 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 ruining the minds of our children. Is it? I just think, I think they should have to put drop rates. That's fair. No, that's completely reasonable. And they just technically being like, do. This is rare. This is like second most rare. Like that, those relative drop rates, I don't care for. I'd rather just be like, you have a 2.5% chance to unpack this item. I'm, I'm just, I'm so of the mind. Like it's fake code in a game. If you cannot help yourself from buying that and you're getting, you know, gambling addiction from that, you got to get some help, man. Well, I'm kind of <laughs> like, I like, literally argued for your cause on Roundtable like an hour ago. And I, so I, I I feel you on that one. I just think like, I'm like, you can do it. It's just kind of a scummy move. I'm not, I'm, I'm just like, come on, when's enough enough? But see, that's what I don't know. Why is it scummy if it's completely voluntary, adds no added value to the game? Whatsoever? Well, I mean, there are kids playing it. Then, yeah. then don't give your kids a bunch of fucking money you don't know. I, I'm not going to argue with that. But I I'm wouldn't call saying. this a kid's game either. I, but it's I also not, think it, but... it kind of like preys upon uh, like an error in human psychology that like, you know, we're, we're not logical creatures as soon as you put like the chance <laughs> to win something big in front of us. And I'm not, again, I'm not saying like you shouldn't be allowed to have like gambling stuff in the game. I'm just it, it does exploit kind of like a flaw in human brain construction. Anyone need a SMG UMP? Uh, I could take it. Come up here. There's a suppy under it too. Oh, thank you, thank you. But my question is, if it's a human error, isn't the error with the user and not with the environment? I mean, I'm still of the opinion that it's not unethical. It's just like a little it, greedy. I guess would be the word that I use. There's boys like I, at these yellow houses right okay. here to the north. I got a 
4x you want to... Oh, I yeah, see. They're out in the open field. Just pop them, pop them, pop them. Okay, 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 okay. He's shooting back. Get him. I need you to hit him. I don't have a scope. I'm trying. The guy keeps fucking swaying. I hit him, but he also hit me. He's an asshole. Knocked him. Nice. Fucking hollow Guy's on sight. the left. Yeah, he's at the red tree. Another one from further away. Yeah, he's more to the left. I hit the one further to the left of the red tree once. I'm just trying to prevent them from getting to their teammate. Damn. I'm one shot away from, like, or one headshot okay, away. Okay, they're... Wait, no, we got rezzed. Okay, fuck me. Fuck, are you serious? There were two of those yellow houses? I'm smoke trying to work my way up. Yeah, I am safe. Are but... you close to the Smokies? I'm still getting shot at. I'm trying to work my way to Austin. <clears throat> I got no Same. optics, though. I got a four. One's flanking wide there. left. Wide left. Okay. Oh, yeah, I see him. You got him, Elf. Let me give you, give you some spray. Uh, I just need to... Oh, they're running. They're running. Yeah, I see him. I see him. They're just running. Just, just, just one of you shoot, one of you pick me up. You give me some cover here? Yeah, I got a fuck up. Am one I? One of you has, has time to pick me up. I'm gonna die. Mel, if you're not getting him? I'll not, get him. well, because I have a 4X, so I was gonna okay. try and shoot. They're running okay. away. Oh, uh, no, they're hitting me. All right, I'm gonna just, I can't, I, fuck. I need to switch my gun. Oh, he's by that tree. Oh yeah, I see him. This is me on the bike. I'm healing. God Yo. damn it. Yeah. Okay, I'm just I don't know this. where they are. He's by a tree uh, to the northwest whoa, 330. Whoa, whoa, whoa. And there's some even further. There's some very, very far. I'm getting tapped here. Dude. Okay, the one by the tree is running. You guys want to get out of here? I don't feel like we have the goods to win this fight. Yeah, I I can't shoot for shit. Here's right a, a firsty on the ground near the bike, by the way. Oh. And, you uh... Get it, Mel? Yeah, I need Here's it. There's two boosts boost. as well for people who need them. Dan, you take the boost. We got a little bit of time. We don't have to go too too crazy. Uh, I got a 2x. Does anybody want a 2x? I yeah, I'll take guys. a 2x, yeah. I also have a hollow. I'll take you, whatever. Do you already yeah, have any fun. kind of zoomies, Austin? I got a 4x. Any, yeah. oh. uh, wait, we need, we need to find something else besides the bike. Yeah. You guys go, you guys go. I'm still healing. Just go. I'll find something else. Uh, Just take the bike, get out, get out. Oh, yeah. Just make sure you guys head, don't head towards them. Head, head, yeah, to the west, southwest. We can meet up at Trench or something. <clears throat> so, Dan, I'll drop you off if we uh, find a vehicle. Gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. Scanning, scanning. Oh, there's a three person bike? Another one, okay. Let's go, let's yeah. Go. There you go. Thank you, thank you. Um,. I'll follow you. Sons of Anarchy, let's go. <laughs> How was Roundtable today? I watched for a couple minutes. Good. Guess we're talking about Sanic. Yeah, Did we're talking it? about Sanic. Uh, I'm not really a big Sonic guy. It's not my, uh, it's not my scene. Uh, kill him. Let's go. Uh, ooh, this is rough. Yeah, Trench, probably. Although I don't have any loot. Dan, you're driving into the blue. <laughs> Just doing like a little you. <laughs> um, Here, Dan, I'll mark this. Do we, you need to hit do we want to do yellow? Okay. Yeah, we're going to yeah. hit that bridge. Either yellow or, or, or red, Ryan. Okay. They're both bridges. The red is just the larger one to the west of Yasnaya directly. Hook a little left here, Dan, just like a little bit before Around we swing towards yellow. Yeah. Because these boys are running right up through here. In fact, there he is, right there. Where? I'm gunning it. That's cool. Yeah, that's cool. Oh, I was peeking. Good eyes, good eyes. Hook back to yellow, Austin. Yeah, now you can hit yellow real hard. 
If they don't have vehicles, you want to get on this hill and like shoot them or? If we can get safe, because they're just going to be eating the blue the whole time. Yeah, well, this hill right here is maybe okay. It's not quite in the in the clear, but. Ooh, careful, Dan. Uh. I think now, like, if we just keep going, we have to keep going. Yeah. Let's just go yellow. I don't know. Ah, I need loot, but at the same time, I don't know. We'd have to rather wait. We can loot the the buildings around the uh, trench. <laughs> oh, Dan! <laughs> Dan drove right. <laughs> <there>. <laughs> <laughs> I guess we're waiting here for them then. I'm pretty sure they're gonna come to this bridge. <laughs> I, don't, I, I have no words, I'm sorry. <laughs> gonna get in this bush. Bandage. There's another bike across the bridge. Uh, we can just wait now. We, we, we'll go, we're, we're within walking distance? Yeah, we are. Yeah. And it's still three minutes. They're gonna be. Pants. Just now on those hills, I think. Uh, I think they were shooting at us right around there. Yeah, Yo, when'd you get those uh those Puma pants, boy? They were like, hey. oh, you mean tracksuit pants? Yeah, <laughs> I've got about seven of them from. Uh... My brain short circuiting and leading to me feeling like it's a good investment to buy keys for the crates I got. <laughs> Does anyone have an absurd amount of five five six? Probably not. No. Right? Uh, I do have a decent amount. You can put up like at least just thirty if you can afford it. I just think they should. Oh, I need seven. So oh, I dropped you thirty. Austin. Have oh, here, here's thirty seven sixties. I just think they should have to show the drop rate. That's it. Why? That's the... that. I agree with that. Because you know, casinos have to show the win rate on like slot machines and stuff like that. Otherwise, it could be like you know, you could win one billion dollars on this thing, but the win rate is like one in you know eighty billion or something. <laughs> you you don't have the information. To... Oh, I see them at uh, one twenty. Oh yeah, yeah. Okay, we gotta let, let them get close. We gotta let them like think they're safe. So get down, get down, get down, get down, get down, get down, get down. We get a head count gonna, on how they're many? Gonna, they're just gonna walk across this bridge and then they're wide in the open. Or they may even swim across. Yeah, one 120 still, like 300 meters. They're stopping. Did somebody show? I I don't want to rat anyone out. But... <laughs> Who was it, though? <laughs> it wasn't you, Dan. <laughs> what a process of elimination. I wonder <laughs> who it could be. <laughs> Let's so go! Remember where you were and we went on Moldy Bridge, boss. Let's go. These guys are gonna get. I don't know. They might just run past now. If Ryan showed. Excuse me. <laughs> I don't yeah. know if they're that. They don't have a view. They have... No, they're coming, big boys. They, 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 yeah, we need to wait till they're like. Mid no, they're looking right at us. They can't. They're definitely see. looking right at us. Well, that just me. means they're 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 scoping. That doesn't mean they know. They're just Scared. like. They're like, Little oh, babies. somebody. Just come on. Could... Come on, big boy. We gonna take him? No, no, no. One's no, no, in no, the right, bush. One is in the bush. Right. Okay, now he's. Austin will make the call. There is a bike there, so that some of them might get on the bike. I think they're looting the house first, though. So they get on the, the bike, bike and then they they get to the bridge, just shoot them. But I think they're gonna drive away. They're on the bike. Yeah. Here we go, One boys. Of the bridge. Yeah, let's light them up. Light them up. Light them up. They need to die. Oh, I knocked one. I knocked one. Nice, nice, nice. nice. They're gonna stay. We have to kill the, the other, other guy. Who's there. He's blabbing. The other He's blabbing. Yeah. Blab him. Other guys are still across the bridge, so. Oh, he's a good blapper. Where? Oh, hey, he's guys. by the rock. Okay. I hit him once. Nice. Yeah, I saw that. You really want to kind of here, Austin? Let's uh, do a little flanky. So there's boys at the trees. Um. Yeah, then, I see one at the other side of the bridge. I'm gonna. He's trying to cross now. I'm almost certainly gonna need a res. He got picked up here. Nice. Oh, the one at the bridge is uh, down. Yeah, I'm not nice. Him. All right, I'm working back to. There's one more to the right. Yeah, by the water. 195. Correct. 195. Fuck. Whoa, this guy by the rock got me. Did you get him, Austin? I did. 
I'm a potato right now, though. So, Dan, he's at like 195 behind this rock near the water, the closest rock to the water at 195. Okay. I will need a res. No super rush. <laughs> is it a pointy Set. rock, Ryan? Oh, there he is. There he is. Oh, also the blue's yeah, coming. Go. I'm gonna, I'm gonna die in the blue unless I get a, uh, unless I get a first aid. I got I bandies and energy drink. I need a res I'll, though. I'll take the bandies. Okay. That's fine. Austin, How did I not kill this guy? Austin, you got mouth? I got him. Okay. No, I don't got mouth. I do not got mouth. Let's see. Well, that's a problem. Here. I dropped four <laughs> bandies. I have four. Oh, we're gonna make it, dude. Austin, can you come get me? I'm please? looting a bunch of shit right here. I'm gonna die if you do not come get me right <laughs> now. No, you're not! You're looting! I'm running directly towards you. <laughs> He's not oh. Did Dan and Ryan just run away? Yes. What are you talking about? We had the other half of the team that we took out. Look at my HP! This was spectacular. Look, I made a... A judicious statement internally before we started the session. I am full unity. I'm dialing down the memory. I'm whatever the team needs. So where were you? R Ryan <laughs> goes, most likely I'm going to need a res. So I started heading that way. Yeah. And then I go. I, I needed a res. This was like two minutes prior to your downage. Are you, all right. There you go. I should have rezzed you, Muff. I'm sorry. Although, even even if I didn't do that extra bit of loot, and I still think you would have died, but I should have gone anyway. Thank you for admitting. <laughs> <laughs> we actually, like, have a chance, as weird as that seems. Unfortunately, the guy I fought used every single one of his heals. Yeah, I'm going to be able to get, like, a little... Probably, like, two-thirds of the way. Oh no! I'm gonna I'm gonna be able to get the max. He did without. have 26 bandages, though. Dude, I will take 10 of those. If you're looking to free up some backpack space, I'm looking to get out of this blue first. Yeah. Also, like Dan, how far do we have to run for the next set? Pretty far. Uh, yeah. Not I mean, not like horribly far, but like think I'm, about leaving. Soon. Yeah, a minute on the clock okay. is about as long as you can wait. Okay. Well. I'm, I'm also not not to be the guy who just comes to you with problems, but I have no ammo for my M16. I, I got a bunch. Is, nice. that, okay. is that 30? You need 30s? Uh, 5.56. I'm sorry. Yeah, I have 30 <laughs> for you. <laughs> All right, we got to go. We got to go. But it's no big deal because I got a supped out micro Uzi. So. Ooh. All right, I'm running. You should be running too. Yeah, I'm just I'm gonna jump off this roof because I'm hard like that. <laughs> oh, are we gonna be? Oh, we're passing up Trench Town. This is where we initially wanted to go, right? Until I accidentally crashed it. Is that I'm crashed? fucking good old potato today. Oh, I found it impossible to. Uh... Hit people with with the AK and the 4X, but I like I can't remember the last time I've actually used that as as like a. I've had a big problem with the 2X lately too. I don't want to be fishing for compliments, but I was getting some mist at like 300 meters with the freaking hollow of all things, and just like, you know that picture of the old lady pulling her glasses up and looking at the monitor, <laughs> like that was me. You guys should hook, hook right towards me, because uh, there's a lot of shooting to the left. And I don't think we're in any business fighting right now. Nice shooting, Ryan, but I will say, I think the hollow I is... see one, too. Underrated. Hollow is, is vastly underrated, personally. We're, oh, nice. Nice knock. I'm not even going to try to tear him. There's just too much going on over there. <clears throat> oh, no, no, I see his boy. I'm not trying to tear his boy. This is... Oh. Uh, I'm being shot. No idea where that was from. I'm just getting to the tree line. Oh my god, dude, this is... Get ready to bust. <laughs> There's a dude... Was that a dude behind the tree, or was that just a... Manish tree? 
It's no, a dude. That's, that's a dude. All right. Calvary's here, boys. Austin, you need a boosty? I could, but I don't know if I got the time right now. Okay. They know now. There's more. I see them further ahead. By the houses. Yeah, I, by I think rock. I see one by the rock at uh, two. Or S-dub. Fuck, I missed him. Bad. My aim is so off right now. Jesus. I'm yeah, he's still... I just saw heads right. moving by that rock again. Did you? Yeah, oh, someone's still uh, running this way. One's running this way. He's by the tree. 240, 255. Uh-oh. Oh, nice throw. Roger Lemons. <laughs> One's yep. on the roof of that building. We don't have to go too far here. Are we going to turret it? What do you want to do? Uh, I think we should try to get towards the shooting range if we can. Okay. We need to... Uh, I kind of want to kill this extra boy, though, because he ran out away from this team. I, I got a lot of loot off of this guy, including a 4X. He's got a ton of 760s as well. I could use 760s okay, and 4Bs. Swap it. Thank you, thank you. Oh, oh I, I see him moving, uh, yeah, 255-ish. I'm such a potato. Dude, you're only as potato as the last shot you took. Just remember that. Ryan, are you using that? All, they all died, I think. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Oh, I see. Yeah. Knocked him. Now, that was a good shot. No, Ryan, you're, you're not wrong. Told you. We should move up. Well, they're weak. They're rezzing inside that house. Fuck it. You know what? Never mind. We should just go. We should just go. The blue's coming. We should just wait for them in the in the safety of the circle. Once we get safe, can I snag a boost off of one of you? Yes. I yes, have yes, zero. Yes, yes. Okay. Thank you. I have a 4X. Do either of you need a 4X? Uh, I do. I do. I do. We'll do boosty and 4 beasts at the same time. All right. Austin, do we need to be where to our right or no? We should be okay, right? Uh, I think we'll be safe up by this rock over here in these trees. That's a big sniper to the north, west, I think. Okay, hopefully we're not in vision here. So we need to watch our ass here. They're going to come around. Okay. We can't all I'm, huddle behind I'm the rock. I'm dropping two stacks of two EDs. Thank you. you got Here's that 4B? This is a 4B. Thank you, thank you. Okay, get ready from these houses. All right, I'll get behind that rock, Dan. Yeah. yeah, rock. I yep. see movement at uh, 150. Yep, 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 yep. We shooting? Yep. Sit nice yourself. Knockout. Sit. Sit. The other guy's getting behind this tree. They have to, they have to come to us. All right, uh, that guy's crawling at 150. Someone, okay, he's down. Good luck, good luck. I just got dinged from somewhere else. And I have no heals. Just keep watching them, guys. I can't fight right now. He's got no helm or anything. He's going to get eaten by the blue. He's in blue right now. I'm getting tagged from, uh, I think it's the southwest. No, it's southeast. I heard it was suppressed. Someone in the blue. Austin. Okay. We knocked him. Austin, Austin, right here. Thank you. Yep. Silenced car, too. Dan, I'd get brown. Okay. Okay, he's resin his boy, I think, near the blue. He's um, gonna die. Oh, no, they're right here to the, to the east, to the east, to the east. Yeah, he's at the tree to the east of us. The lighter colored tree, Dan. This one? Uh, I'm not on your screen. Hold on. To the right? The Y-shaped? Yeah, yeah, right there. To the grenade right that I just yeah. threw. Okay. He's right there. You see him left side. Yep, I saw his head peeking. I need his shit. Do you guys have any grenades? Negatory. I do. I'll run over there and throw one. I hit him. Okay, here comes the throw. Kobe! I killed oh, his I... teammate. I killed his teammate. Yeah. There's one further back. Three. Yeah. Do you have another one, Ryan? I do not. I do. You want to give it to me? Yes. Oh. Oh shit. You got to get Dan. You're good. Please. No, don't don't worry. We got time. We got time. Just f kill those guys first. He died to someone so, else. Someone yeah, behind yeah, him. Okay, him. I got you, Dan. Good luck. 
You need a first? Yeah, please. Yeah, I got you. 33 okay. seconds till blue. Where is this other guy? There's uh, another Fish tree Fish. right behind it. He could be at that. He needs or to leave just... is the thing, and he's just sitting there. And I really need to go get this loot. He's shooting. I think that was. Oh, I got him! I got him! Okay, he's at awesome. sixty. He's at sixty. The, the lighter brown one yeah. on the left. Awesome. You see him? Nice you job, see him, right? Thanks. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Thanks for the call. Can you see him? Can you see him? Nah, he's he's peeking your side. Oh, the blue's here. I'm gonna die to the blue, and so is this guy. Yeah. Oh, why did he stay, man? He could have left, and now he's dead to the blue. Just run, just run, Dan. Oh. oh. Decent yeah. game, though. Yeah. Yeah. Damn it. Well, hey, thanks for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, click the like button. I'm not a great deal. And, of course, subscribe if you want to see more in the future. For now, thanks for watching, and we'll see you next time. Well